protest over the Trump administration's so-called zero-tolerance policy on immigration isn't going away anytime soon. Critics are laying the blame directly on the president and his policies and say many families still await being reunited. But here in Utah, some praise for how Salt Lake County is dealing with immigrants and refugees. KSL News Radio's Paul Nelson is live at the County Government Center to explain. Paul? Well, Jeff, Salt Lake County is getting very high praise from the national organization over how well it not only welcomes uh, immigrants and refugees, but it helps them prosper in the business world. The group Welcoming America has named Salt Lake County as the first ever county to achieve the certified welcoming status. Saffron Valley restaurant owner Lavanya Mahate said, came to Utah in 2001 and now owns seven businesses. Everybody I met through the chamber, all the other businesses, and business leaders and, and, and were equally supportive of my journey. When the national report was released, Salt Lake County had over 6,700 immigrant-owned businesses, which created $145 million in annual income. Reporting live, Paul Nelson, KSL News Radio.